Hello everybody and welcome back to the shop for this early morning episode of Bob TV. <laughs> got to a different one. I got my bag ready. I got my vacuum pump outside sucking down that big old tank. Got all my cloth cut, all my pill plug, got my stuff ready. And uh I'm going to lay up these stabs, throw them in that bag, then we're going to lay up that front duct. Feel a little better today. I was kind of down yesterday. Had one of them just two day headaches, man. Okay. Sitting up in that heater duct for just a minute. Get it a little bit thinner. What y'all think of this winter blast? Man, it is cold out. <laughs> it was cold yesterday. I was priming these parts and just took forever. I had to turn off the heater when I paint, you know, because I don't want the filters clogging up with paint fumes. It'd clog it up quick. So I gotta turn off the heater and open <laughs> the door. And it was cold, man. It was like 20 below in here. <laughs> and the throbbing of a headache. I don't know. I think I was trying to get sick. I feel better today, though. Feel better today. That's my drama I got for you. And now I'm going to take. Layer of four ounce. Remember, I just line up the back edge. I do not want to trim that back edge. started doing that my back edges started coming out so much better I was uh, you know putting my mixture back there because that's a corner and then uh, trimming it and I just couldn't get a good back edge going on man we had bubbles back there, and we just started doing that. Bam, problem solved. That's how you gotta do this stuff. You just gotta keep experimenting, you know. And uh, just once your molds get good in seasons, I got a private message yesterday. Oh boy, must have been uh, big into molds, because he was telling me how he seasons his molds. Is he actually puts eight to ten? Cups. 
coats of wax. He loves that honey wax. That's what he uses. But uh, he puts eight to ten coats of wax, ten minutes between. You know, let it set ten minutes before you buff it off. I've been doing that. And eight to ten coats of wax. And on your first couple pulls, you use part off. He said after that, you don't need to use part off. And you actually only have to wax it every three or four parts after that. After it's seasoned, you don't even have to wax it every time. When he says after you pull, if you wax it eight to ten times, and uh, after you pull your first part, it's seasoned. So I take it he knows what he's talking about. I already had this primer on, but I'm going to try that with my next parts. I got a couple cousins that are real slow right now, hardly working at all. During the winter when it's bad like this. I'm going to try and get them over here. Help me wax all my molds one day. Just sit down and wax them. Because you know I'm fixing to pull some parts. And if I ain't got to put part all on there, that would go that much faster, man. And all my parts would come out good because you wouldn't have to worry about your part all coming out good. But I can see that once they're seasoned, you know. But we sure thank you for your input, you know. And, um, sounds logical. Because, uh, actually, Tom Cook told me he don't use part all either. But I think you have to you know, actually use your molds enough. You know, because a lot of times, you know, like my GB, she'd only pulled four or five planes out of it. And my racers, it was about the same. But like these, this Thunder Chief mold, I have a feeling I'm going to have to lay up a bunch of these things. It ain't going to be long, people. I'll have my servos here in a couple of days. I'll have my carbon for to lay up that new wing. I got ordered. I have my air cylinders to work my gear doors. I have all them ordered through Monica at Cam Lanks. And uh, what else do I have coming? Oh, my batteries from John in Nebraska. Sure, thank you, John, man. That was awful nice of you. Sure, some good people in this world, you know. Sure, we have some bad ones, but there's some good ones too. See how I got them strings of carbon running down towards the tip, nice and straight. 